Okay, darling, so my office was flooded this weekend and I'm a mess right now, but um, yeah, so my office was flooded this weekend. Um, yeah, it was flooded. Um, the back room was not affected because of course everything is in bins. Uh, let me say that it is, it was affected. I actually have the humidifier going on or they have the humidifier going on outside and there's one in here but i turned it off for this video um so i am moving i'm leaving the space um they dissolved my lease uh because it's no longer it is what it is anyway that being said i'm not taking all of this with me to my next location and i was actually thinking of having um getting putting my inventory in a storage unit and just set, just renting a, an office space because oh my gosh it was it was nerve-wracking just thinking about oh my gosh if the water had gotten higher um because out there is a total mess um that being said i decided my bags i'm not carrying i think i have about 100 bags in here so i said let me get on youtube and let you guys know that i'm having a flood sale um and it's a it's a flood sale but not that i'm necessarily putting stuff like on sale on sale um i'm letting you know that i'm taking offers <laughs> on everything um, if you guys want to bundle, like I am not taking all of this with me. So I just want to go through the bags that I have that I have on, on hand and in inventory. And if you like, please go ahead and buy them <laughs> so that I don't end up, cause you know, most of this stuff I want to put in my closet. So I have a few pieces cause I'm in the process of this one just sold. Actually, let me take this out. This beautiful green bag, which you've seen in many a, a video. This oh God, it's so pretty. All right. So let me take that out. All right, so here are the bags that are on Posh currently. So this bag is a relatively new bag. You've seen this bag. Um, it was a part of my Joe Mar haul. And so, yeah, I didn't even get a chance to put it in storage. Or not storage, in a bin. Um, just took pictures of it. This one is a Mark by Mark Jacobs bag. And so this I just listed, hadn't made its way into a storage bin, but there we go there. This one you guys saw in a reel. I actually stole it from my Poshmark um, closet to do the reel. This is Steve Madden. No, it's Aldo. It's an Aldo suede. So pretty. You guys know how I feel about a fringe, right? So this is up on Posh. This one, did I even list this one? Some of these things, John Ashaya, Ashaya, some of these items I had laid to the side, again, because I wanted to do a reel with them, but it just never happened. So this is studded. If you guys saw, I don't think I put that Joe Mars haul. I did a, um, sorry, I'm sweating. The humidifier is on and the AC is like not on so that it can get the smell out. Um, so yeah, so this was in the Joe Mar haul from... I want to say August, September, August, um, July, August. And so if you're following me on Dion Dean TV, then you've seen that. Um, here is a Plinio Visona leather bag. And what I loved about this one was kind of this wooden detail. So there's that. This is a Marc Jacobs bag and I was gonna take this to Disney but you know what happened <laughs> and so I said you know what I am NOT going to wear it to Disney anytime soon so it's going up on posh so this was actually mine that I put up on posh uh, let's see this was fun and it's so funny I remember when I bought each of these bags because you guys know how I feel about a bag um, so this again a fringe bag fringe leather bag for me fringe and fall winter go hand in hand oh, this one and that one are so cute this one is it's all leather I want to say it was made in Mexico if I remember yes genuine leather made in Mexico fringe bag okay so this, oh, this beautiful yellow leather gap bag is extraordinary Look at the inside. I love when they do like the wall leather on the inside and then the yellow. Okay, Dion, you don't need to keep this. We go through this all the time, which is why I have to take a picture. I have to post it and then, oh, my, my bangs. Wrong time to wear bangs. 
I have to post it or list it and then put it away because if not like I want to keep it um here is a bag I want to say this is JC Penny apartment nine JC Penny braided leather faux leather sorry faux leather so pretty um who is this this is Franco Sarto it's a cute little nylon bag you know Prada has been bringing back the nylon bag and it's been selling for me across trends like I sold a Calvin Klein one um that was kind of like a dupe of the Prada backpack so yeah there's that this is a bag that I really was like should I keep it should I not not Prada <laughs> I was gonna say Prada Zara sequin backpack even has the sequin, the sequin back here look at that it's like stretch I saw myself in the airport with this, with like all black, and then you get this black sequin. If it doesn't sell, I'm probably going to keep it. I'm just letting you know. If it doesn't sell by the time I move out of here at the end of the month. Oh, this purple bag. I put it, did I put this on Posh? Why is this in here? I feel like this is mine. How did it end up in here? Was it Wiley? I'll check and see if I listed it. I'm not sure if I listed it, but um, I got this last summer. Just a really pretty purple leather. You guys know how I feel about my vintage bags. And so this, I think I I put it on with a green, orange top, green bottoms, and, and green, no, orange top, pink bottoms? I color blocked it anyway. I just had bright colors, and so I wore this. I'm going to check and see, because that may not be going. Okay. Um, this perforated, I'm all about perforated right now. Something about texture is just something about texture something about texture and so the perforated vintage shoulder bag this cute little bag oh my gosh i'm so in love with these little bags this is zor zoe ann it is a faux leather faux, no available leather agent is white doesn't feel like leather to me. It feels like faux leather. I'm going to check out the brand, but I think it's faux leather. These mini bags are just, they're just all the all the rage with the kids. As you can see, this color is really nice. With a, like white on white, like winter white. That'd be gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh. This is another bag. I had, to, I had to take a picture of it and then let it go because... I was gonna keep this, guys. <laughs> I just love, look at this. This is a leather shoulder bag. I wanna say you could clutch it if you wanted to. It feels so good. Mm, and the details. Can you, can you feel that? Not feel, can you hear? Like how heavy that is? A little mark right here. And zip. Oh gosh. <laughs> Still keeps tickling my hand. I'm like, what's that? It's the label, Dion. It's the label. <laughs> oh, this is such a good bag. I'm so into pastels for the winter. Especially you get like a winter white coat, pale blue, dusty rose. Ooh, okay. Um, did I list this? I don't think I listed this. This is Zara Woman. I did not list this. This was definitely something I was going to, I'm going to list this. Let me behave. I was going to put this in a reel. I was going to do like a New Year's. Because look at that. It's kind of like a play on the, um, like a mini Chloe bag. And it's so weighty and good. I'm going to list this. This is like a $50 piece I just had sitting here. <laughs> so good oh, okay so let me put this here and let me put this here because I'm not sure if I listed them here's another piece another little mini bag this is who what where I'm glad I went through this because I haven't listed this oh, Dion Dean what is going on cute little mini bucket bag I 
honest with this. I know I haven't. I think I was in the midst of moving and I just put all the things that I hadn't listed in the bin and called it a day. Oh gosh. Forgive me guys. So this is just a box bag. You can hear the humidifiers going. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my lord. All right. going so this is a cute little box bag if it fit over my tatas i know it's not going to <laughs> if it fit over my tatas it'd be so cute but i know it's not going to but i like the fringe and i like the shape it's such a cute bag like a faux suede um this was another bag this was mine that i wanted to keep this is supposed to be mine this is mine. This was an MMS bag and I was gonna use it for traveling. I'm probably just gonna list it. I remember when I put this in there because I was like, you know what? I'll list it when I get to the office. I'm glad I went through this pin, guys. <laughs> so it has leather detail. This is another travel bag. I'm always thinking about cool options for travel when the world opens back up. So that Zara, that Zara one, that Zara backpack is everything. And I'm probably gonna put this, let me put that there. So I list it. And then, of course, we always are going to have a vintage bag, are we not? Are we not gonna have a vintage red bag? Look at the detail there. And then, oh, I think on Instagram we had a conversation about this and you guys told me to sell it because you wanted to buy it. <laughs> yeah, here it is, guys. Um, how do we like, I like this actually. Yeah, I kinda like that, all right. And then, last but not least in this bin, we have this kind of Rebecca Mink. It really reminds me of Rebecca Minkoff. Kind of play on Balenciaga. Um, this is by Urban Expressions, but it's very, very much Balenciaga. I totally could fake it with this. People, are, people will probably think it's, it's Rebecca Minkoff. But this is a good bag. The thing that I like about it, you see that? Yeah, the handles. You could totally rock this. Oh yeah, this is a good bag with all black. Yeah, this is good. Um, and then last but not least, shimmy shimmy ya, shimmy ya, shimmy ya. <laughs> this is just a vintage, really, I'm gonna think about this one because I feel like this would be a good birthday bag. I don't know, let me know in the comments, what should I do with this bag? All right, so this has been number one out of five. Um, I am going to give you the first two bins. I'm gonna do this one. I'm gonna upload the second one. I'm gonna go do some work. Like I said, I'm prepping everything to be moved. I have to go find another office space. Um, and so I'm gonna do some work and then I'm gonna come back here and film the second one if I have time. But I said, let me jump on while I'm in here um, because This is not what I wanted, but God has something amazing for me on the other side. So wherever he's moving me, it's because that's where I'm supposed to be. All right, my darlings, I'm going to pack this up and get ready to, um, like I said, go do some work outside and cleaning up and getting out there situated because that's where most of the damage was. Um, and yeah, I will come back and film um, the second bin. All right. Thank you so much. And again, please make offers because I'm not taking this to wherever I'm going. These are some heavy, <laughs> heavy. These are just bags. Wait until we do shoes. Um, it's going to be something. All right. Love you guys so much. Mwah. Bye. Where is the top of this? That.